On April 26th, 19,000 more documents related to the Kennedy assassination were released, giving conspiracy theorists and history enthusiasts something to obsess over for a few days. The only problem is, this batch is kind of boring. There's not much there except for an interesting 1975 interview with CIA counterintelligence chief James Angleton, who believed two New York Times journalists, Ted Salk, now dead, and Seymour Hersh, still living and writing, were actually working for a foreign intelligence service. He would not admit that they were Russian spies, but said the CIA definitely had files on them. Ooh, the plot thickens. Anyways, since this release was kind of a conspiratorial boner wrecker, we thought it might be fun to address another set of JFK facts, the ever-circulating list of quote coincidences between he and Abraham Lincoln. For example, Lincoln had a secretary named Kennedy, and Kennedy had a secretary named Lincoln. So in rapid-fire succession, here's the truth and fiction to several of the claims about these two presidents. One, let's start with that one, the secretaries. False. While JFK did have a secretary named Evelyn Lincoln, Lincoln's secretaries were named John G. Nicolay and John Hay. Two, Lincoln was shot in Ford's theater and Kennedy was shot in a Lincoln, which was made by Ford. True. The vehicle Kennedy was shot in was an SS-100X, a beefed up 1961 Lincoln Continental. Three, John Wilkes Booth was born in 1839 and Lee Harvey Oswald was born in 1939. False. Booth was born in 1838. Four, both the Lincolns and the Kennedys lost children while in the White House. True, Willie Lincoln died of typhoid in 1862, while Jackie Kennedy gave birth to a premature child who died in 1963. Five, John Wilkes Booth ran from a theater and was caught in a warehouse, while Lee Harvey Oswald ran from a warehouse and was caught in a theater. False, Booth did run from a theater, but was killed instead in a tobacco shed. Six, Andrew Johnson, who succeeded Lincoln, was born in 1808, while Lyndon Johnson, who succeeded Kennedy, was born in 1908. True. 7. Lincoln was elected to Congress in 1846, while Kennedy was elected to Congress in 1946. True. 8. Lincoln was elected president in 1860, while Kennedy was elected president in 1960. Yes, again, true. 9. The names Lincoln and Kennedy each contain seven letters. Which is true, even though, come on guys, it's a bit of a stretch. 10. Both presidents were shot in the head on a Friday. True. 11. Both assassins were killed before they could stand trial. True. 12. Lastly, Lincoln was in Monroe, Maryland a month before his assassination, while Kennedy was in Marilyn Monroe a month before his assassination. As much as we want this to be true, false. Marilyn Monroe had tragically passed away more than a year before Kennedy was killed. What's your favorite Lincoln-Kennedy coincidence? Let us know in the comments, and be sure to subscribe to Raider Red's YouTube channel for more strange Heartland history. I'm Christopher Pilney.